greetings from Aging Technology. Next to me is a bit better with this model LGHXJL2. This machine is intended to use in the uh, intensive care units to supply oxygen and air to patients. As you can see, it consists of three main parts the main unit, humidifier, and the processor. So the okay, let me show you how it works. First, let me connect the uh, Plaque inserts a socket. Plaque inserts a And connect the AC. Then, let's turn on the compressor. When the pointer goes in the green area, we can turn on the main unit, the monitor. See the way it is. Pointer is in the green area. Let's turn on the button. Now you can see the standby interface, which have two choices for us: VTH and VTL. The first model is uh, for the adult, and the latter one is for child. So we, we can choose as per the, the actual situation of patients. Uh, let's, so let's go with the first one. Now you can see we have several modes of the ventilation. IPPV, PCV, AC, and so on. It, it actually has eight kinds of modes for different patients. And we can, we can turn in the, the knob to change the settings the vital volume frequency peak we change by ourselves we can change the data press again okay then it goes to this interface we can see the there are several icons on the screen here is a space for the uh, alarm and the mode of the meditation and the mode of the adults or the children first you can, you can hear the alarms now we can uh, we can press this button to turn off the sounds this is the mute key to turn off the sounds and here is the controlling panel the mute key and the system setting meditation setting information and manual control and standby key check this the greatest lock we can lock we can lock the monitor to prevent some patients by uh, touching the monitor by some accident and the organizer organizer we can turn the organizer here see this icon and we can also adjust the uh, ratio of the oxygen 20% and 1% okay this is the mode of the ventilation different modes for different patients so it will be adjusted by the doctors they will uh, change the modes as per the actual situation of patients and also Doctors can change the settings. And here is the uh, information of the FIO2 and VPAW and the information of the alarms, O2 supply low. So the, it will show some uh, data of alarm. And this, this button is to uh, control the Ventilation, many ventilation. See? Many control. And we can also turn. And let's see uh, this button. This button is to. We can turn this button to adjust the oxygen, the ratio of the oxygen concentration. And here is to connect the nuclear port 
the tube to add some jack signal caps and connect the nuclear port. And this one is a humidifier to, uh, to get some humidity of the oxygen or the air for patient to be feel more comfortable to, to breathe in the oxygen or the air. And we can adjust the, the heater, the heat control here. And you can see some uh, indicator, indicator. You can turn on the indicator. And then, uh, here's the compressor. It's very easy, very easy to show you some uh, information here. The total working time, output, output of the oxygen. It has the pressure here. You can see pressure, airway uh, pressure, and the uh, indicator of the uh, machine. Run, just run, alarm. And here's the switch. You can turn on or turn off the machine. Okay, so uh, basically, uh, this 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 type of ventilator, we have eight modes of uh, ventilation, and we have fourteen alarms. And uh, the most important, we can use both for adults and uh, the children. So it's very convenient for doctors or the hospitals they use in the ICU. And uh, sometimes when the power is off, we can also use a backup battery to continue working for two hours. Okay, thank you for watching.